Hello, welcome back. <coughs> what I want to do is to look at a simple task in regards to fabricating an electrical installation. Now, this is to provide you purely with information as to how tray work can be done, okay? And some of you would have done this already. So please be aware and look at how the information is being provided and try and see how you can implement it in your own work when you come to do so, okay? Now, tray installation is part of any electrician's task, whether you're doing it commercially or on a industrial or commercial installation, okay? The principle will still be the same. Now, there's nothing for me to read here to you, okay? So please use the information and look at the diagrams for yourself okay now you would have similar diagrams at the college or the training center that you work at purely to show you how certain things need to be done Now again, I've simply labeled and made sure that you can identify the relevant cuts in the relevant sections that you need to look at, okay? And again, I'll just pan out here, okay? Now again, please read the information. Now you will need to make sure that, remember that 245 degrees angle cuts will make up a 90 degree and that's what you're looking to try to achieve okay and there's your task okay now again All I've done is to provide you with additional information showing you how these cuts are made to so use the information provided. Again, purely for your information only, you can read this. You don't need me to read for it. Just follow it, you'll see that the numbers are relevant to each diagram in turn. So please refer to those relevant diagrams. Now, most of you should have done this work previously, so it should just be additional information for, for yourselves. Okay, and that should bring us to a con conclusion. Okay, 
I hope you find this information useful. Again, thank you for your time. Have a good day. Bye-bye.